Please kindly notice that the UI has been renewed. Similar tools are grouped and after tape feature is added. Hold on on Select Mesh Tools group to choose Select Mesh Box Tool in the sub-menu. Click and drag on the pattern to create marquee box to select the desired area. Release your mouse to finish. Then you can click on the selected area to move it by using gaze mode. After activating simulation, the selected part will be disappeared and the meshes will be back to original place. Use this function to move meshes to be inside or outside of a garment to avoid collision. When you stop simulation, the tool will be changed back to select mesh box. Click on our vertex to select it. Double click on our vertex on our segment to select the whole segment. Double click on a vertex on the pattern to select the whole pattern's meshes. Also, you can select the meshes into the window. Hold on on Ctrl and Shift key when selecting to multi select the area. Hold on on Shift key while selecting to invert the selection. Hold on on Control key while selecting to delete the selection. Hold on on Select Mesh Tools group to choose Select Mesh Lasso tool in the submenu. This tool is similar to Select Mesh Box tool. Click and drag your mouse to freehand an area to select. You can use gaze mode to move the selected area. Also, you can multi-select the areas as the same as using Select Mesh Box tool. Hold on on Select Mesh Tools group to choose Select Mesh Brush tool in the submenu. Then you will open the Brush setting window. Click here to adjust the value of strength. Click here to adjust the value of size. Click here to adjust the focal of brush. You can see the internal circle of the brush will be changed as the focal is changing. When you click and drag your mouse on a pattern, you will see an area become greener as long as you move. The area is way too gray to show the strands will get smaller on the edge. Also, you can multi-select the areas as the same as using Select Mesh Box tool. Right-click on the selected area, then you will see the pop-up menu. The first option is Subdivide. After choosing this, there will be more meshes in the selected area. You can adjust the level of the subdivision. Choose Smooth to smooth the edge of the subdivided part. Press the LED key to delete the subdivision. Choose Create Pane to create pane on the selected part. When you activate the simulation, the pink part will be solid. And you can also choose to roll the meshes up. You can roll the part horizontally or vertically.
The last one is freeze. You can freeze part of the garment for your convenience.